Okay guys, for those of you who don't know what Mud and Wheels is all about, you probably think you're looking at the differential to your daddy's old pickup truck. Even though this diff is almost the size of a Ford 9 inch, this is actually a Can-Am Maverick rear differential. We're going to take this baby apart, strip it down, and we're going to go through the pros and cons of what makes this sucker tick. We'll be back in a bit. Okay, and for those of you who think that size really matters, we're going to give you a shot here. Um, on the far left, the regular Gen 2 diff, weighing it at 16 pounds. In the middle, the 1000 XMR, weighing in at 22 pounds. And over here, the big daddy on the right, the Maverick differential, weighing in at over 30 pounds. Okay, and we're back. Uh, we got this Maverick differential all opened up and we're going to go over some of the features and uh, right away you can see that uh, these gears over here those are the XMR gears and you can see right away that the Maverick gears are quite a bit bigger. Um, one thing you also notice is that the bearings on the ring gears from the XMR to the Maverick are the same bearings but the pinion bearings got much bigger on the Maverick diff, both the dual tapered roller bearings down low and then that needle bearing that'll ride inside the case. Okay, so looking at the case, you can see that this uh, pinion boss area, it's enormous like everything else on the Maverick differential. Again, if you look down the barrel here, that needle bearing down inside is much bigger than the XMR that's a win lots of webbing and strength built into that pinion boss area if you twist one of these apart boys you're having a real bad day um, the diff has got a three bolt mounting pattern um, it looks very rigid and strong uh, I don't think we'll see a lot of cracking on this mounting system, um, but time will be the judge of that. So overall, uh, the big improvements of the Maverick differential is just sheer size. I have seen some of the same build deficiencies as I've seen in the G2 diffs and the XMR diffs as I see in this Maverick diff. Uh, Mud and Wheels is going to be putting this Maverick diff into production. And if you're one of those guys that thinks that size matters well and you're blowing these diffs up, there isn't anything bigger on the market. And I'm going to challenge you to run one of the Mud and Wheels Maverick differentials.